Meghan Markle backed by Hollywood star over decision to quit royal family. Meghan Markle has been backed by the Queen star Dame Helen Mirren over her and Prince Harry's decision to quit royal duties. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are leaving the monarchy behind for a new life in North America. And Dame Helen, 74, has said she hugely applauds Meghan and Harry's decision to stand down as working royals. The actress, who won an Oscar for her 2006 role as the Queen, told Variety, I think their instincts are absolutely right, and I applaud them for it, hugely, actually. Of course, it is complicated. Meghan Markle was a fantastic addition to the royal family, charming, did everything right, was gracious, was sweet-natured, and seemed to be, wow, cat a lovely addition. Didn't seem to be neurotic. So, I think it is a loss in a way, but at the same time I think their instincts are absolutely correct. Dame Helen is the latest celebrity to publicly back the American former actress. It comes as Meghan and Harry officially end royal duties on March 31st. The Sussexes plunged the monarchy into crisis last month with their bombshell statement revealing plans to step back as senior royals. The announcement sparked emergency royal talks to sort out their future roles. After completing their last round of official engagements, Meghan and Harry will stop representing the Queen and become financially independent. They are paying back the pounds 2.4 million of taxpayers' money spent renovating their Frogmore cottage home and they will drop their HRH titles. Meghan and Harry have also been forced to abandon their Sussex royal brand. In a widely criticized statement on their website, which will have to be rebranded, they conceded that the word royal could not be used amid their decision to leave the monarchy. Harry stepped out in Edinburgh yesterday at a summit for his Sustainable Travel Initiative Travelist. During the engagement, he asked to be introduced as Harry rather than the Duke of Sussex. On Friday, he is teaming up with John Bon Jovi for an Invictus Games event. Meghan and Harry will also make an appearance at the Endeavour Fund Awards, which recognizes wounded, injured and sick service personnel, on March 5. The following day Harry will join Formula One's Lewis Hamilton at the official opening of the Silverstone Experience, a museum about British motor racing. On March 7 the couple will step out for the Mountbatten Music Festival at the Royal Albert Hall. And Meghan will mark International Women's Day on March 8. Their last official royal appearance is expected to be the Commonwealth Day service at Westminster Abbey on March 9. The Sussexes have already started making the most of their newfound independence. Earlier this month they attended a J.P. Morgan-sponsored alternative investment summit in Florida. Harry gave a speech at the exclusive event in Miami, with speculation rife that he pocketed hundreds of thousands of pounds as a fee. Meghan Markle to return to Hollywood after Royal Rift Rumor has it Meghan Markle could be heading back to Hollywood sometime soon. The Duchess quit acting to marry Prince Harry in 2018, and in light of their recent shock departure from the royal family, it has been speculated she will return to acting. According to U.S. Weekly's Hot Hollywood podcast, Meghan is rumored to be actively looking for roles on the big screen and is willing to step back into the Hollywood spotlight. Meghan is actively looking for representation. She has begun outreach, a source reportedly told the publication. It can be a manager or an agent, but she's reaching out to people to find someone to represent her for future professional projects. The whispers aren't the first sign Meghan is keen to return to acting, with Harry previously revealing at the Lion King premiere his bride does voiceovers. Within six months of the red carpet revelation, it was reported that Meghan had signed a voiceover deal with Disney in return for a donation to charity Elephants Without Borders. Meghan rose to fame playing Rachel Zane in the legal drama Suits, before quitting acting to marry her beau in 2018. Since then, there have been multiple reports that the Duchess is longing to get back into acting, and in the light of recent events, a TV or movie role could be in the cards. Meghan's rumored return to Hollywood comes after it was speculated that her recent relocation to Canada may have jeopardized her five-year process to citizenship. According to Express, Meghan's time out of the country could ruin her chances of becoming a natural Briton, or at least affect her eligibility this time round.
The government website states in order to be eligible for British citizenship an applicant must adhere to strict criteria, which includes remaining in the country for a set period. You should not have spent more than 270 days outside the UK during the three years before your application, or, spent more than 90 days outside the UK in the last 12 months, the website states. Meghan Markle shock, could Meghan return to Hollywood after royal family snub? Meghan Markle could become an actress once again after she gave up the profession when she got engaged to Prince Harry. Since stepping back from the royal family, the Duchess of Sussex is said to be looking for an agent with an eye on returning to the silver screen. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle left the UK for Canada earlier this month after negotiating their divorce from the royal family. The move followed crunch talks with the Queen, Prince Charles and Prince William at Sandringham where an agreement was drawn up. The Sussexes will split their time between North America and the UK and work towards becoming financially independent. Though they will likely still receive funds from Prince Charles and the Duchy of Cornwall, Meghan and Harry will need to find sources of income. They have applied for trademarks for the term Sussex Royal, which would permit them from using the brand to make money off things like books and clothing. However, they might have to ditch the brand because they are losing their HRH titles which would bring into questions Harry and Meghan's status as royals. So could Meghan soon be making a return to Hollywood? The Duchess of Sussex gave up acting more than two years ago before marrying Harry. She left her role on TV drama Suits in 2017 after she and Harry became engaged. According to a source quoted in US Weekly, 38-year-old Meghan is actively looking for an agent or manager. Speaking to US Weekly, the source said, Meghan is actively looking for representation. She has begun outreach. It can be a manager or an agent, but she's reaching out to people to find someone to represent her for future professional projects. Harry was filmed telling Disney CEO Bob Iger that Meghan did voice over at the Lion King premiere in July 2019. And earlier this month, the Times reported the Duchess had signed a voiceover deal with Disney in return for a donation to Elephants Without Borders, an organization which helps to track and protect the animals from poaching. The couple is reportedly pursuing multiple avenues, including voiceover work, as they push towards becoming financially independent. They also want to produce documentaries centered around worthy causes like climate change and mental health. Meghan and Harry have in addition to Disney, also attracted interest from streaming service Netflix. On working with the Sussexes, their chief content officer Ted Sarando said at the Screen Actors Guild Awards in Los Angeles, who wouldn't be interested? Yes, sure. According to The Sun, Meghan has started negotiating with fashion brands. A source told the newspaper, Meghan is very connected in the fashion industry and there are a lot of major labels who would like to partner with her on projects. There have already been active discussions with Givenchy. Some of these deals could be worth millions of pounds. I'm sure she is going to link some of the initiatives to their foundation.